Hello and welcome to Sobrix. I'm Adam and this is Sobrix. This is my channel for reviewing Lego sets and building them and other Lego related stuff. In this video I'm going to be taking another look at the Lego Star Wars Lego Star Wars Advent Calendar for 2023. This is set number 75366. It has 320 pieces and I paid $27 for this set. It retails for $45 but I was able to get this on sale. This is the first year I've done a Lego advent calendar and today we are on day 12 here so I've already opened up the first 11 days and so in these videos I'm gonna open it up if it's a minifigure if it's a small build I'll put it together and then I'll give my quick thoughts on it and then I'll be doing that uh, every day for the whole 24 days here and this will mark halfway through so I can kind of give my thoughts depending on how this goes and I'll just kind of keep talking as I go through this so I'll look for number 12 here pop this open okay I have to look at the directions here to make sure I know how to build this and uh, then we will look at what we have so we have a little bit of a build but I think it's it's kind of similar to the pit droid I think it's kind of an in-between type thing here so let me see what we have and I believe I know what this is it could be some oh actually a full brick here that's pretty interesting and uh, I think this is a gunk droid, but let us see here, or I hope I'm saying that correctly, uh, but they do have to print the instructions on the back of the flap, which does make for some interesting stuff. Uh, I've found these are a little more of a puzzle to try to put together than a typical modern Lego set, which I appreciate it. It's, it's kind of nice in its own way, uh, that, that little kind of reality here. And I suppose I didn't think very much before I bought these and before I'd ever done one, um, how they were going to do the instructions I just hadn't really crossed my mind frankly and uh, this makes a lot of sense I thought maybe they would do like the little instructions that they put in poly bags or something like that but anyway we do have the day 12 build here so this looks to be like a uh, a little a uh, gonk droid and I believe it is supposed to be a reindeer here so the gonk droids are pretty popular I think some of them from back in the day are actually quite valuable in Lego form uh, maybe from certain certain sets I know I have like the original uh, Millennium Falcon set from I think the 90s 99 maybe or something like that but I'm not positive I do have the first one and uh, from when I was younger and I don't know if that came with a gonk droid but I know I have some old gonk droids I don't know if I have the ones that are, are valuable but either way here we have a gonk droid that is in kind of made up to look like a reindeer here so they're traditionally very boxy they might have a little feet here so the overall shape for this makes sense the horns here using these kind of clip pieces that also can uh, receive a bar element there are kind of the antlers those bits would not traditionally be on a gonk droid so it does change it a little bit this kind of ingot piece here is maybe for eyes quote unquote if they have them we got the little nose there we do have a little tail at the back and we have the little feet i think this does kind of fit all of the uh, kind of required elements of a gonk droid and it also does look like a reindeer so as far as these go it's not really a minifigure this is the kind of holiday pit droid that was there not really a figure but kind of a figure or they're figure adjacent but they're also tiny builds you know I, I think this is really good I'm surprised they didn't do like a red nose here and just a black nose maybe that wouldn't have worked well uh, but that's okay and I'm also um, I don't know if this is a real problem because I don't know if 
depending on what the pieces are used for any of the old gonk droids, I believe some of them use pieces that can open up. Either they have a hinge that place that opens or they use like a crate piece, but I'm not sure. This one uses a solid two by two brick here. Would have been interesting to if they if they used uh, a different piece there so that you could open this up and potentially put something in there, which I don't know if is canon for gonk droids, but uh, it's just something that I feel like I remember from Lego gonk droids. But this is a uh, Pretty cute, pretty fun. Uh, color choices are, are good. The build was uh, quick and easy. It's a, it's a reindeer gonk droid, so that's pretty cool for day 12. I, uh, I, I like it. Um, we do have some extra pieces here, just your three, uh, your one by ones, your tiny pieces there. And uh, yeah, that was fine. So if you like this video, please click the thumbs up and give it a like. If you like my other videos, make sure you click the subscribe button so you can stay up to date on all the LEGO videos I'll be doing here in the future, including the rest of the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar for 2023. And I'll be looking at uh, the Marvel Advent Calendar as well as some other sets like I'm normally doing on my channel. So subscribe if you're interested. It does help me a lot. I appreciate it. And with all of that said, until next time, Thanks. Bye.